Hello, and welcome to another Go Engineer Quick Tips video. My name is Matthew Francis, and today I'd like to show off how to use the tab and slot feature inside of a weldment feature. Previously, we have created some Go Engineer videos showing off the tab and slot feature in Sheet Metal, but today I'd specifically like to deal with weldments. There are some additional parameters that we need to enter when creating a tab and slot feature inside of weldments, so let's go through and explain what those are. To start tab and slot feature, I simply go up to insert, sheet metal, tab and slot, and my tab and slot menu comes up and it instantly puts me in group one. The first selection that it is asking for is tab edge, simply saying a linear edge. So I know I want to connect these two members together, so I'm simply going to say this edge here. And this next selection is the face in which the slot would be applied to. Um, that would be the inside face of this member. That's sometimes a little difficult to select from this face, so we can use something like select other to go ahead and say select that back face. For this instance, I'm going to do an offset of 0.25. I'm only going to have one tab, or one, one tab. The length will be 0.5, my thickness is going to be 2.5, and then this is simply saying the tab face in which we want to apply the tab itself. So I'm going to say let's apply the tab here, and you can see it already gives me a little preview as well as my rounded edges because I've gone ahead and selected a fillet edge. The final parameter at the bottom is simply saying the slot offset or slot clearance, and that is simply going to be with 0.25 for this instance. Now let's say I had a wanted to add a second uh, slot here and tab. Um, that would be a new group based off of the different edge, different face, things like that. So again, I would come and select my edge. So I'm going to come and select my edge again. Back face. So again, we know we need to do the back face. So I'll simply say select other and select that face. Going to keep all our other parameters the same. Again, the final one is simply asking which face we want to actually apply that tab to. Okay, once I've got my two faces selected and now everything else is happy, we can go ahead and say green check and you can see very quickly SolidWorks will build a tab and slot feature based off the parameters that we have shown. Now let's say we take this one step further and apply another tab slot to a sheet metal and weldment part together. So I have my sheet metal gusset here and I have my weldment member that I would like to add a tab and slot to. So again, we're going to go up to insert, sheet metal, tab and slot. Again, new group. We're going to pick our edge. Now for this instance, again, we need to pick that back face. So I'll simply do a select other and say that face. Our offset should be, let's make our offset 0.5 this time, and my length is going to be an inch, and my thickness is fine. Again, it wants to know where to apply the tab. Now this one's a little more fun because again we got to go through selecting faces. So again we'll go through select other and wait for it to highlight the correct one. That looks good. I like that. And you can see it creates that tab and slot for me. Now let's say I wanted to add a second tab on this side. Because this is a separate member, structural member, it actually would be a separate, not even a separate group, but a completely separate, separate slot, tab and slot. Only when it is the same member or same body does it allow us to do the same groups inside the tab and slot. So this would be a new tab and slot. So again, insert, sheet metal, tab and slot. I start my group, pick my edge. Pick my face, and then do my offset of 50. All the other parameters are good, so I just need to come and select the face to create the tab on, and say select other, and come and grab that gusset. Sometimes if you're not quite lined up with it, you need to do it again. And again, everything else is good parameter-wise, so go ahead and say green check. You can now see that I have two tab and slot features on my sheet metal part going into my weldments, showing off the tab and slot feature. Again, 
My name is Matthew Francis, and thank you for watching this Quick Tips video.